Yo guys, what is going on? It is Royal here today, back for another episode of the Gen series. I believe this is episode 7 so far of the free-to-play series here on royal.enchantedmc.net. Of course, if you guys are looking for a Gen server to play, bro, look no further. This is one of the best Gen servers out there. I played a couple, and I'm telling you guys, this one is one of the best ones. But anyways, guys, for today's episode, we are for sure going to be hitting at least Prestige 75. And at Prestige 75, if you guys don't already know, we are going to be unlocking the credit finder enchant. We are already prestige level 65, so we have 10 more prestiges to go. It's a little uh, ways away, but there's just been a fat content update drop that is like in specific very, very good for free to play players. But anyways, guys, I kind of have to go quick. We're going to go to slash spawn because I am making a purchase in today's video. I just, is he not at spawn? But uh, this is why I started recording. I'm going to message Kurger Bing. Okay, that's what his name is, but we are going to be buying the brand new set that literally just dropped like a couple minutes ago there was another content update they dropped new crates and new bundles and new sets and the new set is absolutely nuts i've been using this coin set first of all the entire season okay but there's like a wizard set that gives you 0.375x all stats there's a jurassic set there's an ocean set but the final one that just dropped is the pirate set and the pirate set is giving us 0.5x to all family wait oh my god slash milestones i need to claim this guys we did get Boom, 500 credits right there. We got the pirate set slash credits. Pay a uh, burger. Bing, we bought it for 750. So I know 750 is a lot of credits for a free to play player to give, but trust me, a 0.5x to all stats. That's going to be 0.5 to coins, orbs, money, enchants, level. I think it's pretty worth it. All right, we have 380 left, but we did claim our 500 credit milestone right here, which uh, was kind of a lot. But, anyways, guys, yeah, fat, fat content update. I don't think I know all. All of the updates just yet but one of the updates is going to be these treasure chests right here that you can get from mining farming or fishing so i've already been in warp farm while they dropped the update i've been here for a little bit and i already have three treasures and if we take a look at these things bro they are absolutely nuts look at all of the rewards you can win enchant crystal boxes which i really really need skin keys um all of the loot boxes but i'm assuming the loot boxes are going to be uh pretty low percentages to actually win but tool perks would be insane and probably the most likely is going to be the gen slots and then like the little boosters that you pop like in my inventory right now but either way it's gonna be good so i have three of these let's go ahead and get these three down to start off the episode and of course first one we're gonna get some money boosters at least they're very good boosters and oh wait i just opened up all three um we got two money boosters and a level booster so so far um didn't get anything good out of the update but i barely started farming and we have already pulled three so for right now let's switch over to our brand new pirate set i've been saving a little bit of shards anticipating waiting for an actual good set so we just switched over i say we just try and max out momentum because orbs chance to spawn red fireworks that will generate a range of orbs i guess this could be decent wait we could make orbs while farming now the question is how many orbs are we realistically going to be making from prosperity i don't know but i would love to find out i don't think we have enough shards to max everything out but the main thing that we're going to focus is going to be momentum because that is going to give us a level booster which is uh the most important to me at least in my opinion so we can keep prestiging as much as possible but now um yeah we are basically out of shards just like that i guess i'll do like a best friend and boom we are shard poor now i do actually have these farm keys right here that we can go ahead and claim we can open up some crate keys uh for this intro just to see if we get anything worthwhile i do have 33 enchanted pet boxes that we are also going to open up and wait slash sets i gotta throw on the nexus skin set right here oh my god that reminds me guys slash pass as well you guys know i got the premium pass in the last episode i believe so we've been running through this but right here at tier 42 free reward we get two skin keys my first skin keys of the entire season but we have been saving these enchanted pet boxes trying to save up for an enchanted pet all right we're getting one of those in today's video because it is just it's necessary but yeah we've been working on our slash pass and we actually just got two skin keys out of it so actually slash crates let's open up these two and we really if possible want to see a violet skin i believe or we would like to see a lucky block skin of course so we're just gonna do in the middle and then the first reel right here anything else i don't really think we need oh wait that that is a lucky block and it went past boom we have a booster host skin and a fireball pickaxe skin unfortunately i already have a booster host skin on this thing if i look at the abilities i bought it off ah for shards so that was kind of useless i am not gonna cap to you oh my god infinity enchant pet how much is that gonna go for credits wise because he's saying offers i don't have a whole lot of credits right now but i think maybe fishing if we look if i fish up like 200 more fish we can 
can get an extra 100 credits. I just don't know what that pet is actually going to go for, but I really, really do want it. So we got ripped on the skin keys. It's fine. Hopefully we get some more. Let's go ahead and open up 300 enchanted keys. Honestly, you don't really get anything too crazy out of these anymore. And then slash crates, 200 farm keys. Boom. You do get a decent amount of these books of experience from the farm keys. So we absolutely love those. But now for the moment of truth, all right, these enchanted pet boxes, can we pull an enchant pet? I've already opened up so many of these and I haven't gotten one. So doubt we're going to get one in today's intro, but we might as well still try delete pets. Let's go ahead, bulk delete all of the basics. And there we go. Now we can keep on opening, getting level pets, pass, coin. I am just not seeing an enchant pet. I don't know if you can actually pull one from these pet boxes. I was just assuming you could. And yeah, it is looking like we might have to save up some more credits and we might have to buy ourselves an enchant pet because I am getting absolutely rinsed. But anyways, I think that's everything I had planned for today's intro. I am going to keep working on the slash pass guys. And on the next page, these right here, we are going to get two Jurassic loot boxes, which hopefully, oh, and then tier 45, bro, three Jurassic loot boxes are coming up. So definitely going to reach that for the next clip. And then out of these, yeah, some tool perks and stuff. If you guys watched the last episode, bro, I literally got so rinsed on my tool perks. We have magnet too. I am back up to 43. So screw it. For today's intro, we're going back in. We need to see a decent perk. I don't know if 43 was enough, but I am tired of magnet two. I need at least magnet three back or magnet four, mermaid three. Let's just double check. I don't think we want this one. Um, yeah, that's orb boost. You don't really make any orbs while farming. So we're going to keep going and it's getting scary. We got magnet two once again, bro. I am going to lose my mind. We do not want that in the slightest, bro. We're, we're running out of options. If we get magnet two again, we'll take it and leave. Otherwise I'm running it down, bro. I'm running all the way down and whatever we get for the last one, we get magnet one. Nope. Bro. Oh, bro. Mermaid five. I thought that was magnet five. I almost freaked out. Not good enough. Uh, running it down. Demon three. Hold on. I mean, this is for the pass, bro. The pass is kind of giving good rewards. So you know what? Um, until we get some more tool perks, I guess we're going to have to take it and run with it. What the hell? A rainbow enchant pet, bro. I have got to get my hands on one of the enchant pets in today's video. But screw it for right now, guys. We're going to go ahead, keep grinding, keep grinding or slash pass, leveling up and prestiging as much as possible. I will catch you guys in the next clip. All right, guys, we're back. This is probably going to be a pretty quick clip, but hopefully an important one nonetheless. Okay, so in the last episode, guys, I figured out at the end of that video that we can actually upgrade our companion chances of getting some just better companions, to be honest. So didn't know this was a thing. I have everything upgraded to level 40 and I mined out some more orbs. Now we have 5.2 billion left over. I'm not going to lie. I feel like if I max upgrade all of these, um, all of our orbs are going to be gone. And I would like to see how good this possibly is, but I don't want to spend all of my orbs because I think at level 75 or prestige 75 we're actually gonna get some new ones but if we can pull some voids and stuff out of this that would be absolutely insane and right now 500 million orbs is really not a lot at all so we're gonna give this a couple of rolls and pray to god we get some like rainbows some voids anything that isn't just normal you know so right there boom we just rolled that and okay hey we got a couple of shinies right here um normal nor i mean all right let's give it let's give it one more spin bro if we don't get like not one rainbow or one void then we're probably gonna give it up and just wait until we're prestige 75 so let's see we got a decent roll of companions right there and it's looking buns okay it's looking like it's gonna be a really quick clip but we have been farming a little bit i do have 12 treasure chests let's go ahead start popping these open we got three special stats out of that one we did get a 5x level booster which again is really good pet traits five gen slots coin booster another five gen slots money booster enchant crystal box wait oh my god no this is huge bro very very big it depends what we win out of it obviously but i'm very happy with that win let's open up the last couple boom honestly didn't get anything too like super crazy but these right here if we pull a laser crystal guys we're gonna be up or even like a coin magnet crystal i would be happy with coin magnet coin greed or laser or maybe even a flash i guess would be okay ish second hand actually would be pretty good and actually we can max out second hand right there and we still need to max out farmer fred so i guess that's what we're gonna be dumping our farm coins into next but let's hop into it, bro. First enchant crystal box of the season. It's going to be a barn crystal. That's that's not great. All right. <gasps> that's laser. That's a laser crystal right there. What is the boost percentage? Please, dear God, be good. 59? I, I, I don't hate it. It's obviously not the best ever, but I mean, it's going to be better than what I have, which is nothing right now. And bang. What is this? Coin magnet. Oh my God. Wait, we absolutely take this. We got two 59% boosts. One for laser, one for coin magnet. I'm not going to complain, bro. Out of five crates right there, that is actually amazing. How many slots 
do we have? Yeah, we only have two more slots anyway. So this is legit perfect. And wait a minute. Hold on, guys. Yo, Hamboy is helping out the series. He just gave me some better totems. Um, I'm just going to kind of take it. I'm not going to lie. He did slide me this level totem right here as well. So, I mean, like, I'm, I'm not going to deny this. You know, it's just going to make me a little bit better. The enchant totem is definitely a big increase. The coin wasn't that big. And I mean, the money isn't that big. But hey, a boost is a boost. And just like that, we got both of these laser crystals or both of these crystals, I should say, to 100% success. Bang. They're not the best boosters, but they are definitely going to make a difference. Oh my God. Wait, bro. Our laser enchant is up to 6% proc chance. I swear, before we added those crystals, I could have sworn it was sitting at like 2.7% or something along those lines. I could be wrong, but I mean, that activation chance, we are going to take that and we're going to be making more coins as well with the coin multiplier. You know what? Successful clip, but in the next one, I think we're going to be hitting prestige 75, unlocking the credit finder enchant and getting some brand new level companions to level up even quicker. Wait, hold on, guys. I sold. Hold on, bro. I'm an idiot. Slash pass. I did get all the way up here, which means we are getting three Jurassic loot boxes. I don't really think these sell for credits anymore, so I'm just going to open them for the episode for me. I don't know what you can win out of these things. Honestly, if we could get some tool perks, oh my god. Tool perks would be amazing because we're sitting on Demon 3 right now, and I'm not going to lie. I don't really want Demon 3, so let's go ahead and rip open the first one, and I am completely fine with seeing tool perks as the final reward. Maybe the orb pouches in this are actually pretty decent as well. Ooh, wait, enchanted pet boxes are pretty decent. Maybe we can pull an enchant pet and 25 gen slots. You know what? Can't hate it. Let's go ahead and move on to the second one. I do have a decent amount of books of experience just stored up here waiting for my luck to, you know, actually help me out and we pull an enchant pet. Right here, money pouches I don't think are that great. Final one, 25 tool perk rolls. Like I said, I absolutely take that. Final one right here. I would love some more tool perks, man. I can't lie. I would love some orb pouches though out of like, you know, the four rewards right here because we're getting money and stuff which isn't that great and i mean totem boxes i guess yeah i mean kind of rinsed final reward jurassic set Ooh, hold on would this sell for some money enchant slash money family i would love to sell this for some creds wait hold on guys this guy just offered me 200 credits for it i'm actually gonna sell it um slash spawn i'll take 200 credits for this um i already you know have a good one so let's go ahead and walk over here hop in this little corner and uh hopefully i don't get scammed i'll go ahead and toss that over hopefully he sends the creds if not i'm cooked no he sent it over gg's 200 credits i i actually take that he said love the vids shout out to vake right there i am actually super glad with that opening now let's go ahead open up 20 of these enchanted pet boxes any enchant pet i just i just don't see it dude this is starting to get depressing man but look now i'm at 585 credits i think that's enough to go ahead and buy one and wait we do have tier 4 totem boxes let's see if we can pull anything insane like some upgrades and stuff might be a better uh coin totem right there better orb totem for sure oh my god 1.72 x enchant totem which is better than the one that we just got given by ham i am taking that and we actually did get a solid or boost totem as well hey man actually w pass bro w slash pass that was actually really good when's the next time we get something like insane though i don't think it's for a fat little minute i mean we get another jurassic loot box at tier 50 uh one i believe that was and then the rest yeah good god this is gonna take a while we get an element loot box at tier 58 and shout out to jesse guys i mean is this really cheating dude it's almost you know towards the end of the series shout out to jesse thank you gave us some upgrades right here i'm gonna go ahead and take that let's also slash shop and we need to buy 72 of these purple terracotta generators as well because we just got so many extra slots and bang there we go just upgraded that we have a hundred billion dollars left over as well don't think that's gonna be enough to get the full farm to the uh purple terracotta and yeah it wasn't but we are very very close so guys now let's take a cut let's go get to prestige 75 i will see you guys in one second and just like that guys the big prestige 75 we are a high enough level to do it let's go ahead and get this done i've been upgrading a bunch of enchants i just prestige coin greed prestige coin magnet and i was saving for lasers so i don't really have a whole lot of farm coins to upgrade credit finder right off the rip i should have probably saved a little bit more but it's all good because we are about to dump as many coins as we're earning straight into credit finder until we max it out unless it gets like ridiculously expensive i don't know how expensive it's actually gonna be but yeah slash prestige let's get this done boom prestige 
Prestige 75, and we do get some new milestone bundles, and we also unlocked some brand new companions, and they're costing 100 million orbs per companion now, which is a little heavy. Let's go ahead, open up this treasure chest, more gen slots. I did pull five more. Enchant crystal boxes right here. Angel, I don't think is very good. Bait, let's just spam them open, bro. Bang. Um, honestly, yeah, super mid. But let's go ahead and take a look at our hoe. We have the credit finder enchant right here, and I do also believe warden is pretty good for crops it is at least and oh my god wait that reminds me we just unlocked a brand new crop we are now on bubble coral so hopefully this makes like a massive difference in the amount of money that we are making and we're already starting to make a pretty good amount of money from farming so we're gonna check that in a second i am literally dumping all of my coins in a credit finder it's only gonna be level three thousand out of ten thousand but again i didn't really have a whole lot of uh of coins saved up but i do want to see how much we are making per auto sell inventory right here because before i think it was like 270 million ish so let's see if we can wait for a proc right here and see how much it's gone up 540 million dollars per cell bro that is absolutely amazing i can't lie because we fill up our backpack like dumb fast already and we don't even have all of the crop enchants like upgraded i've been like really neglecting them to be honest and we just unlocked the new enchant warden which should also get us more crops i mean it is a billion coins per level so uh definitely super expensive but really quickly slash milestones we do have a start of the world loot box right here we have some totem boxes right over here on farming special stat rolls this one um we have two star of the world loot boxes and then that should be like everything to be honest let's get down these three star of the world loot boxes i don't even know if there's really anything we can win out of this that would be good maybe like books of rarities would be decent but even those wouldn't be like super crazy so i'll just take whatever we can get here let's see what we got we got a fireball skin and an ocean set wait ocean set might actually sell for some creds one last star of the world loot box right here and actually i'm gonna ask in chat right now and see if anybody is selling a in chat pet because we have i think 500 credits should be enough to get one hopefully but final crate right here another nexus skin actually if we could have won a violet that would have been really good but wait this might actually sell for some credits as well and wait a minute hold on guys i just saw people are buying those treasures for 30 billion each i'm not gonna lie we might have to start selling those just so we can start maxing out our enchants a little bit faster because 30 bill bro that's like a really good price i feel like that's at least like for me like at least 20 minutes of grinding per treasure that's that's pretty insane and guys we have found a seller for the in chat pet right here let's go with tpa accept so not right here did play skyblock with this guy let's reddit's pay i already trust him i know this dude's not scamming me boom 500 creds for this in chat pet right here thank you very much and it's enchanted tier as well so warp farm guys we have everything we need we do need a pet scroll actually real quick to make this into my pet bang there we go now it's mine claim this slash pet i think we get rid of our money pet bro honestly and then we run the enchant pet i'm not sure if that's a throw make a little bit less money from farming but i think it's gonna be worth it so before we start grinding with this brand new pet let's go ahead go to pet traits and uh yeah we're gonna try and get buff three on this thing i don't have too many rolls so if we get like a buff two i might just have to stick with it nah i have 39 more tries we're gonna keep going because surely i get another buff two if worst comes to worst right buff three absolutely amazing that is perfect the only thing better than that is like godly now pet stats i think this is gonna be the last pet we ever get stats on so we're really gonna be like shooting for gold here bro we are trying to make it to the moon i am spamming all of these oh my god ss and buff ss and level and then experience is a b let's see if we can get an s in uh experience that's an a plus do we just you know what no 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 bro we have so many rolls right here i'm not taking that boom s is across the board on the in chat pet literally all i have to do is actually level this thing up because it is level one out of 568 luckily we have a ton of uh books of experience the thing is the early levels are so easy to grind so i'm not gonna use these books of experience on it just yet i might try and get it to like level 200 and then we'll put all the books of experience on it just because bro if i farm for like 10 seconds right here we're probably already gonna have like a level 10 pet right like slash pet boom already level 21 like that so it makes no sense to use these books on the early levels i'd rather just manually hand grind it and then whenever the levels get harder then we use the books but uh i guess we'll go ahead slash crates we have a ton of keys to actually open so let's go ahead store all of these boosters real quick we do also have a book of rarity i wish i could use that on this in chat pet but i can't dude that is unfortunate we'll go ahead and use it on this mythical plus pet right there level pet boom and then wait can we fuse all there we go we are now up to an enchanted plus level pet so that is an upgrade slash crates let's get into it bro books of experience is what we want to see almost an entire extra stack right there which is a w i don't really know if you pull enchanted books from uh enchanted keys but i didn't have too many anyway so not a big deal boom 
there we go. All right, guys, I'm going to take a cut. We're going to go level up this enchant pet. I swear to God, I really feel like I have like all the means necessary now to be a top player, bro. We have good pets. We have a Nexus skin set. We have the pirate set. I'm, uh, I'm feeling pretty good. We just unlocked credit finder. And yeah, I think I'm going to sell these treasure chests for right now uh, to get more coins and stuff. Because if we do slash P warp real quick, let's just go take a look, bro. Best shop. Are these guys buying treasures? Oh, they are for 30 billion. So like, how do we sell this thing? I've never sold anything on here before. Sell one. The shop is out of money. No shot, they're poor. Okay, we came to this guy's shop right here. Sell one. Boom, 30 billion farm coins just like that. Yeah, we're going to start selling those for right now. And really quickly, let's actually roll some of these brand new companions and pray to God we get something decent. There are a billion orbs per roll. So, I mean, per 10 rolls, obviously. But yeah, we're going to run out really quickly. We have three more rolls in us. And final roll right here. I haven't even been paying attention. Hopefully, we've been getting some decent uh, companions. Now, let's take a look, bro. Legendary. Oh, wait. I thought these were going to be like voids or something. They're just normal. Mummies are all normal. We did get some shiny. We got one shiny Anubis, bro. This stuff is not not the same at least it feels like as it is on uh on dungeons like the upgrades and stuff we're gonna try three pharaohs right here to get a shiny it's only like a 60 percent chance so screw it and it failed all right ggs bro we got cooked all right guys a bit of a random clip back but i was going through a h and there's actually a violet skin in here for a thousand shards and i've been using my nexus skin for like literally the entire season but yeah i think a violet skin would go absolutely crazy especially because we have the pirate set so i'm gonna buy this for a thousand shards we're gonna equip it slash sets oh uh, we're gonna switch out the nexus skin the nexus skin is giving me enchanted keys but i just feel like i don't even really need enchanted keys anymore so this is what the new set is looking like and i was about to hit a sell on the gen farm so let's go ahead equip the money totem let's go ahead and find ourselves a decent money booster if we can we'll take this little 4x right here 15 minutes absolutely and then slash pets do we have we don't have our money equip or our money pet equipped so let's go ahead and equip this and i think just like that, we're good to sell. We have the offhand with the Fortune 3. Let's sell the hopper. Um, Boom, $470 billion right there. We will take that. We are continuously still upgrading our gen farm. It is coming along pretty nicely so far. Also, we're at 119 credits. So Credit Finder has made us. I think in the last clip, what? We had like 82, 84 credits or something like that. So Credit Finder, obviously, you're not going to be making thousands and thousands of credits with it. But you can definitely make like a couple hundred credits just from grinding, which I think is going to be perfect. I don't even have the enchant maxed out yet. The enchant is super expensive and I think for right now I might want to focus like other enchants that are helping me level up faster and stuff. But also slash pets, we did max out the level of our enchant pet right here. So this thing is giving us a fat, fat boost. Like guys, we are leveling up so fast now. And I have been selling a couple of my treasure chests. Um, I think I have some. Yeah, I have a lot on AH. Can I like get these back? Oh, click to cancel listing. Okay, so I did already sell a couple of these. I think we sold like 10 and then the rest of them bro these are really expensive so a lot of players can't actually afford them even the oh wait what the hell am i doing even the shop i was selling to in the last clip i think they closed their shop because they just got ran out of farm coins so i guess we'll go ahead just open up these eight for this clip let's see what we end up getting money boosters oh wait a skin key that's actually pretty decent especially if we can get like a lucky block pet stats honestly don't really matter to us anymore 10 gen slots right there though not bad at all coin booster and then another 10 gen slots we still haven't pulled ourselves one of those crates but also dude that reminds me slash pass real quick boom we just got 25 uh tool perks and then we got a whole nother jurassic loot box right there the rest of these honestly we won't get anything super good for a while these tool perks though are definitely gonna go insane once we uh reach tier 54 because you guys know my tool perk right now is kind of buns let's see how many tool perks do we have oh my god we have 100 tickets we're gonna be spending those in this clip as well and praying for some sort of purple perk literally any purple perk but out of this oh five bucks of rarity on Honestly, that's not even that bad. I think we'll go ahead and use these books just on our coin pets because it's easier to actually level these things. Or maybe not. Nah, you know what? We can throw some on the level pet as well. Boom. There we go. We're out. But that should be a tier up for the coin pet, I believe. We should be at like enchanted. Pl oh, we're at infinity. Absolutely. We take that. But now guys, perks. Yo, cue the montage because we are rolling this. I am not stopping until I pull like at least magnet five or we get one of these purple perks right here. Oh my God. We got master two. Is that worth it though? is the question master two 60 percent enchant 40 percent level 40 percent crops i mean it's worse than magnet five on the enchant and level dude but master two can i pass that up i'm gonna say i'm gonna say no 
I'm gonna say I can't pass that up, dude. I think I have to take that. It's not the greatest, but it is definitely better than what we just had. Because we had, like, what, Demon 2 or Demon 3? Or maybe it was Banker Bro. I don't even know what we had. Oh, no, it was definitely Demon because we were getting the pass buff. Yeah, I'm gonna stick with this. It's not the greatest. Well, let's go ahead and warp farm. Let's keep it pushing. I have 242 billion farm coins, by the way. And look, that is only gonna get me 3,500 levels of credit finder. So, still won't max it out. Or I can, like, prestige this enchant right here. Which, I'm actually gonna go ahead and do. Bang, that used a lot of our farm coins right there. And then, can we get another prestige of this? Oh, my God, we can. Bro, laser is just so good for levels. I just feel like there's a better enchance to be focusing right now instead of credit finder. Credit finder's not bad, don't get me wrong, but like, I think I'd rather just level up right now because especially if we can hit prestige 100, this coin factory enchant, guys, is literally insane to make coins with. So screw it, I'm gonna do another prestige onto this. Bang, there we go. That should be the last prestige I think we can get. Yeah, the next one is gonna be at prestige 100, but look at the activation chance on laser and it's level 2,800. We have 80 billion left over. And I think we're gonna go ahead and use it on coin boost boom prestige that as well now that is the highest prestige that we can currently afford now we have 25 billion left over which is basically nothing that was worth like 500 levels of credit finder and we are once again broke but either way in my opinion huge huge update clip right there i do also have like an extra 50 gen slots that i'm gonna go ahead oh wait we can actually prestige boom there we go but yeah we have like an extra 50 gen slots so i'm gonna have to save up money for that luckily we are still making good money from farming and wait we just got a brand new violet skin as well i forgot about that that should actually help our coin production like per minute bro 1.8 billion coins per minute with no coin finder and no boosters even pro wait did i say coin finder i'm at coin factory all right coin factory gives you like a couple billion of coins every single time it procs but yeah basically 2 billion a minute no boosters i will take that so i'm gonna take a cut right here guys i don't even know what i'm trying to get to in today's episode i'm just trying to progress as much as possible so yeah i'll see you guys in the next clip okay guys i believe this is going to be the final clip of the video hopefully you guys have enjoyed you know the longer uh episodes the last two videos right here but we're back and we have been grinding off camera and if i just take a look at my scoreboard bang we are at prestige 99 guys with all of these upgrades I'm not gonna cap, bro. We have leveled up so fast. And with the enchant pet as well, we also do have 300 billion farm coins. So I'm gonna hit a prestige. This is going to be prestige 100 on the season as a free-to-play player, which I think is absolutely insane. Our hoe isn't the greatest, but it's definitely not bad in my opinion. I feel like we have all of the important enchants. And the reason why I have been saving up all of my farm coins is because we have just unlocked coin factory and wow we can't even max this thing out that's uh actually kind of crazy so we can get seven levels which is 70 percent of the way max but the next level is 60 billion farm coins but i did want to show off this enchant because it uh i believe it's pretty insane let me go ahead and turn off some chat messages for some of these enchants though because it is a little hard to read but i think like one coin factory proc gives you like a billion to like two to three billion farm coins per proc which is absolutely insane there we go wait we just got a proc 1.4 billion coins from coin factory inch and look at all of this stuff still going from like second hand and farmer fred and all that stuff but anyways guys listen i think that's gonna go ahead and do it for the video prestige 100 we haven't maxed out coin factory yet but i mean it's almost there so anyways hopefully you guys enjoyed if you did drop a like sub if you guys are new obviously come check out the server with my custom ip it's greatly appreciated and uh, yeah i'll catch you guys in the next episode